<laughs> well, someone's sleepy. Oh, yes, you are. You just yawned so loud, I'm sure our neighbors even heard it. <laughs> I know, it's okay. I'm pretty tired, too. We've had a long day, haven't we? It was really nice, though. We've never spent all day together before. I'm really excited that we get to spend the night with each other as well. You are so cute when you're sleepy. My little sleepy, snuggly bug. Oh, don't pretend you don't like it. I know you love the pet names. Oh, stop it. You're not fooling anyone. Not even yourself. I think it's time for us to get some shut-eye. What do you think, sleepyhead? You want to go to sleep too? Well, get over here then. Come here and cuddle with me, you sleepy little snuggly bug. Hello? Are you so sleepy that you can't even hear properly anymore? <laughs> I said, come cuddle with me. What kind of couple sleeps on totally different sides of the bed? Come hold me, silly. Hey, baby. It's okay if you don't want to cuddle, you know? I thought maybe you wanted to. But you look really uncomfortable right now. And that's okay. Not everybody likes to cuddle. Not everyone is comfortable with being held or touched. Especially since we're, you know, the same sex. So if you don't want to cuddle, or even be really close to me while we sleep anyway, that's okay. I understand. I'm sorry. I was probably too forward when I asked you. I just... I was just trying to make a joke. But I think I came off too strong. I can tell I came off too strong. I'm sorry. You're not uncomfortable? Okay, that's good. I would never want to make you feel uncomfortable. I know I'm very goofy and silly, but I know that's not always appropriate or appreciated. Well, if you're not uncomfortable with cuddling, then what is it? Do you want to talk about it, maybe? You're too embarrassed to say it? There's nothing to be embarrassed about, baby. I'm your girlfriend. You can tell me anything. Especially the things you think are embarrassing. I'm never going to laugh at you. Or tell you that you're overreacting. I'm always going to validate you, sweetie. I love you, remember? Do you feel comfortable telling me? I can hold your hand. If it would make you feel more confident. Okay. Let me hold your hand. And you can tell me. <laughs> Sweetheart, that's okay. It's nothing to feel embarrassed about. I know I'm your first girlfriend. So I understand that we're going to have a lot of firsts with each other. I don't mind. I don't mind at all. I understand why you're embarrassed, though. I understand why you're scared. It's scary to be vulnerable with someone else. It's scary to kiss someone for the first time, or hold their hand for the first time, or even hug them. It's all scary. I know. But you did it all with me, and it feels so good to know that you trust me like that. Sorry, I'm rambling. The point that I intended to make was that we don't have to cuddle if you're not comfortable with it. I'm just happy that we get to spend the night together. That's enough for me. You want to try? Okay. You don't have to know what to do. I'll show you. 
But first, we have to decide on a cuddling position. <laughs> so let me get out my imaginary cuddling guide. Question one. Would you like to sit up or lie down? Lie down? Me too. Okay. If you selected lie down, please go to question four. Okay, question four. Would you like to face each other or face away from each other? Away? Okie dokie. Let me consult the guide. It says if you selected face away from each other, your recommended cuddling position is spooning. Please turn to page six for instructions. Okay, page six. Here we come. It says here that we need to decide who's going to be the big spoon and who's going to be the little spoon. The big spoon holds the little spoon. So which spoon would you like to be, baby? You pick first. You want the little spoon? Okay, I'll be the big spoon then. All right, come here, little spoon. Let me give you the best cuddles of your life. You have to face away from me, baby. Turn around, please, and thank you. Okay. Let me just get in behind you right here. <laughs> what should you do with your arms? It's kind of hard to decide, isn't it? Just put them in front of you for now. Let me just get really, really close behind you. Hi. <laughs> I told you that I have to get close to you, didn't I? Okay, I'm just going to reach my arm over you and hold your hand. See, we're doing it. We're cuddling. Wasn't it easy? It feels nice, doesn't it? Now what? <laughs> Nothing, sweetie. This is it. This is cuddling. We just lie here and enjoy each other's company. You know, it feels nice to be with the person you get to share your first cuddle experience with. I hope I'm doing a decent job. <laughs> I am. Thank you, baby. I love you, too. Yeah, it is kind of hard to kiss when you're spooning, isn't it? Just crane your neck towards me for two seconds. There we go. Can we go to bed now? <laughs> yes, we can go to bed. My cuddles are just that good, aren't they? We haven't been cuddling for that long, and you're already half asleep. I know, I know. I'm so amazing. You don't have to tell me. Let's just go to sleep now, baby. I love you. Sweet dreams. <laughs>